Shoulder pads, flock of seagulls, and new coke. What do these three things have in common? Well, to tell me all about it is Phil Gorley from Hospice Wellington. Thanks for joining me today. Hi, how's it going, Ryan? I am great today because we are talking the 80s. Specifically, we're talking retro royale 80s, all to help Hospice Wellington. So can you tell me a little bit about this event? What do we have in store? Yeah, we have lots in store. Retro Royale, uh, we're doing a nostalgic kickback to the 80s. Actually, Hospice Wellington started in 1980, uh, and we thought uh, we would have a fun event, inclusive for all to come. Um, lots of great, exciting things that are going to be taking place. Um, definitely focused on the theme of an 80s thing. We're encouraging people to dress up. If you don't want to dress up, we have glasses for you. Um, but just getting into the spirit, we'll be having lots of entertainment, music playing, um, we've got uh, great foods that are going to be nostalgic, a candy bar that's got some retro candy there. And of course, a whole lot of uh, fun items in like live auctions, silent auction, um, and all sorts of different types of fundraisers that we're doing that are a lot of fun. Uh, this is all to help a good cause. Can you tell me a little bit about what this the money raised for this event will do to help Hospice Wellington? Yeah, so all the money that we raise at all of our events that we do out throughout the year go towards a couple things at hospice. One, of course, the residents upstairs. Uh, we have a 10-bed facility that uh, we have for people who are at end of life. Uh, and we also make sure that we're taking care of their caregivers, family members that will be coming by. We have a great kitchen there. Um, lots of supportive programs. We also do things throughout the Wellington County um, to help with people who are caregivers, uh, who might need some visits in home um, and just uh, make sure that the, the, they are being taken care of as well. Um, this year, actually, one of the things that we're doing at the event, we do a, a fund a need uh, where we bring up something that's highlighted that needs a little bit of funding that needs a little bit of attention to raise some money for. And this year we're doing caring for the caregiver. Um, so lots of different support programs that we do for people before and after um, uh, if somebody has passed to, to make sure that they are doing all right. All right, last question. Uh, for people out there who might not know much about Hospice Wellington, why do you think we should go out and help you? Definitely. Um, if you don't know a lot about Hospice Wellington, first I would say make sure you are le learning a little bit about hospice. Um, as you mentioned before, it's not really... Uh, a lot of people get the impression that it is a sad place to go. It's not a sad place to go. It's a great place to help support. Um, there's a lot of, that comes with somebody that might be passing away uh, for a family to deal with. And so it's definitely important to go to. And you're, if you are coming to this event, you're helping so many people in the community, so many people throughout Wellington County who do depend on these services. So we really appreciate it. And also, it's a fun event. You're going to have a great time. We promise you that. There's lots of fun stuff. There's takeaway stuff that you'll get to take home. Uh, and we're really going to be nostalgic. You're going to go back to a bit of a time that you're going to be like, wow, this was a lot of fun for an event. So not definitely we want you to come out. All right, beautiful. That's Retro Royale 80s, February 15th, Delta Hotel on Stone Road. Bring your Rubik's Cube, rock your mullet, crank up the bangles, and visit hospicewellington.org for more information. Phil, thank you for joining me today. Thank you so much, Ryan.